Hello. In this video, I'm going to show you how to upgrade this 9.4 inch uh, NEC screen from uh, one CCFL to our LB series. This LB series is specially designed for a this 9.4 inch CNC uh, displays. This kit comes with one LED strips, one custom make driver and wires. So let's take a look screen. This screen, uh, you know, it's made by NEC. It's also using on the Fana CNC uh, display. It's 861-0001-0138. inch screen. So up front is a brand new screen. You see this? NL6448AC30-10. Okay. See it? Okay. The part number for final is A as Apple 61-0001-0138. Okay, again, this is 9.8 a 9.4 inch screen. Obviously, this is a controller board. Uh, this is a uh, the, uh, LED drive. I mean, seats uh, in rotor to drive this CCFL. So let's set it aside uh, for a second. I'm going to show you how to upgrade this. Really simple. First, we move this one. So basically, the way you remove is I want to show you. See like this, click, push up. After you move out, you tilt up. Kind of like tilt up a little bit. Yes. There we go. Pull out. Do this side too. Okay, just slowly. You don't want to damage this one. Take it out. Two screws here to hold in the old inverter board. Okay. So, to school, uh, we're going to pick it out. Okay, the connectors on the bottom. See this? So, basically, just pull it. Set that aside. Let's take it to the backlight lamp here. There's a two wires, one screw. So, we need to unscrew this thing. Okay. Um, usually, the I would suggest either you can pull the wire out or just use long nose. It depends because some screens, uh, if the lamp's been on for a while, it generates some heat and melt, melt a rubber put on end a little bit. So, okay, this one now. I have to just grab. Oops. Oops. Okay. Got to do this long nose. is not it. Oops, let me see. It's a little bit tricky than what I thought. Here we go. So you pull up, show you. See this thing? Mail down a little bit, stick to the, the light guiding glass. All right, so let's set the screen for a second. Take a look at our LB series. This is the reflectors. Perfect. We can mount it back. So, but the trick is because the bottom is wrong. So you can either put some silicon in between or when you mount it, you just be careful. If you try to push all the way down, it will be, it shouldn't, it won't sit on the flat on the bottom, which might like this. We are affecting the brightness level. So just be careful. This thing's really simple. I just get a, I can just, just cut it off. Okay. All right. Take it out. This thing I need to, let me see here. Well, I can just bend it because we don't need to use it anymore. Okay. Wow. Degraded. See that the coating? All right. So, mount it like this. Perfect. Oh, if you want to, you can add a little bit double side tape to, to fill up the wrong bottom one. See, um, if you fill up a little bit, so make sure it sits flat. That would be, it helps a little bit. So, just give a sample here. You can just do it on both ends, that's fine. Um, kind of like, kind of like, oh, it's too much. I need to split in half. Just make sure it's in the bottom. Show you when you get it done. You saw this?